This video is brought to you by the lovely sponsors below. Thank you so much for your support. The enemy is near. Nice. Good job, Fuma. I'm picking up a faint poisonous smell in the air. Are you of the same mind, Fuma-san? Yes. An assassin. Alright, I'll stay clear. Just like we planned, Usashi will draw them out, and then you two pins from both sides. Make sure you get in quick before they activate their reality marble and lock you out. Understood. Roger that. And Okita? Yes, Master? Come back alive. I'd like to talk to you when you come back. Yes, I'd... I'd like that. Please, stay safe, Master. Heroic Spirit, Seven Master Swordsman Showdown! Showdown Battle 3. Yo! Musashi Miyamoto vs. Assassin Paraiso, Carcass of Chiyomi Mochisuki. Will the low become the high? Begin! A cursed Kunoichi who wields an array of hexes and summons. Chiyome Mochizuki is not to be underestimated. Even my clones will not be enough to take on her dark arts. The first time you engage her will not be a normal bout. Starting with 643,400 HP, she will not utilize her noble phantasm here. Instead, using an extra attack. But be wary of her skills. Her Witchcraft Oracle skill can seal the NP of one of your party members for one turn. Second, Serpent's Curse will increase her art's performance, and grants her a chance to inflict curse damage for each attack for three turns. Finally, her Kurgaryu skill is her evasion skill, with the added effect of charging her NP gauge. The second time you face her, all bets are off, and you will be forced to bring Musashi to the front lines. Starting with 321,700 HP, Assassin Pareso now has the permanent ability of applying curse and attack down with each attack. Upon breaking her first bar, she will be left with 437,512 HP. However, a delayed buff will now be applied to Assassin. At the end of her turn, she will randomly stun one member of your party every turn. The most worrisome part of this fight is not knowing who she will stun so you must be prepared to have a contingency for each member of your party. Being a summoner, Chiyome can summon the fearsome power of the Serpent God, who cursed her through her noble phantasm, Kuchiyose Ibuki Daimyojin Engi. A single-target arts-type noble phantasm, it deals damage while inflicting a skill seal for one turn. A caster with debuff removal abilities will serve you well. Both the witch Medea and her younger counterpart are exceptional examples, with Medea's Rule Breaker removing the enemy's buffs while dealing damage, and Medea Lily's Pain Breaker removing any pesky debuffs. The Atlas Uniform Mystic Code can surely add extra insurance, with its invincibility and debuff removing skills. The combined efforts of these two can stall the enemy's assault, and bring you eventual victory. But what is a victory without the proper armaments? If you choose to include either or both Medeas, equip them with a craft essence that can raise their arts performance and NP power, such as Dive into Blue or Khalid Sapphire. For a more defensive option, equip a CE, that with debuff resistance and or immunity, such as Primeval Magic or Vessel of the Saint. Conclusion! Winner, Musashi Miyamoto. <gasps> Listen. You can still turn this around. Master. I don't know your situation, but you have to see you're on the wrong side here. Even as a demon, you can still be saved. Come on. Join us. I... Uh, Master! <gasps> my, my. It appears that foreign master of Caldea has a silver tongue. Is that... Shuten? I do apologize for this, Assassin. However, I just can't let you leave. Not alive, anyway. No! Musaki! Let go of me! We can still- Please stay back. 
She may look like our Shuten, but she isn't! So you've ran into me previously? No, you seem to know my true name. Regardless, as of now, you are my enemy. Now, I wonder what will happen when the Lord finds out about the betrayal of the doll playing ninja. <laughs> hmm, I wonder indeed. You wouldn't! <laughs> How silly of you to think that I wouldn't. Now, show me your resolve, Musaki. <sighs> Damn! We need to chase after them now! We can't let Kado be found out! If that's the case, we should tell Musashi and plan our next move. Now's not the time for your stubbornness, Master. Think smart. Don't let your emotions cloud your judgment. <sighs> right. Let's get going then. To be continued! Next time on Kaldia Guru's Shimosa Boss Guide 5, Hellrider and Berserker.